So we have a range of 16 buttons. In this video, I'm just going to show you how to update uh, three of them. And the same uh, update process would apply for the rest of the buttons. So let's go to the master CSS color changer. Uh, we had to do quite a bit of custom coding to get these buttons to look the way they do now with the nice animations and the effects on them. Uh, so you are going to need to look for the button name. Yeah, we've got super size. So we go to buttons and then super size button, large size button. We've labeled them all out on the front end as well as on the back end. You can see your large size button, base size button. Let me show you quickly how to add one. You're not gonna add from library. You have to add a module. So insert module and then add from library and then you would scroll down to the particular button that you want. We've made a nice little screenshot for them as well. So super size button, that's the one we want there. I'm just gonna hit the update button. And then what we wanna do is let's start updating a few of these things. You, you're gonna need to experiment to get them exactly right for yourself. I've done a little bit of uh, testing beforehand and so I'm just gonna go and update them. This uh, super size button, the background is white. You can see on hover, it's white. And then it changes to a gray. I'm gonna change that to a mint green. And we're gonna do the same for this gray over there. This is all part of the super size button. Then we've got the large size button, this one. We're gonna update that as well. And then the base size button, that is white. So we're just gonna leave that one. Uh, in fact, let's change it. Uh, now we can copy all of this. Then we're going to go into our custom CSS for the page. Let's paste it in there. Let's save an update. And let me just hit the update button. And then we can reload and have a look. So that's changed. This has changed. And that's changed. And for the rest of the colors, including the text on top, we need to go into the module settings themselves. So let's open the super size button here. Uh, let me just grab a, another color, dark green here. And then we can go through these. You can change the text on the button, as you can see there. We can change these components. So let's change this uh, button background color to a darkish green. We'll leave the rest the same. Let's do a quick preview. There you go. So that's what that one looks like. Now we can save an exit for the large size button. Let's have a look. We probably just want to change the text on that one. Button text color, there it is. Let's change that to a dark green. And let's see what that looks like. There we go. So that's this effect. I don't think some of the styles are picking up, so uh, we have to save and exit. I'm just gonna go to the last button so we can quickly do that. And then we can look on the front end and see what that looks like. So here we got some purple. I'm just gonna do that. <coughs> the green again and I'm going to do the same over here let's save and update and then we can go to the front and have a look there we go that fix is there that one's set and this one's also doing what we want I see there's a hover color on on that one let's go take a look quickly design you just want to scroll through these settings there we go there's the hover color uh, and we can make it a let's make it that color save let's hit the update button and then reload so that's how you update these buttons thanks for watching